Ponte Sant'Angelo was built by Emperor Hadrian so Romans could visit his mausoleum. During the Renaissance, the bridge was adorned with 10 angelic statues by the students of Bernini. The original mausoleum for Emperor Hadrian was completed a year after his death. In the Middle Ages, Castle Sant'Angelo was a crucial fortress. Later, Michelangelo created a chapel within the courtyard of the angel. Tranquil Villa Borghese was inspired by English garden designs and built for Cardinal Borghese, nephew of Pope Paul V. Galleria Borghese was the former family residence now it's a popular museum with an outstanding collection of paintings by Caravaggio, Titian, Raphael, and Rubens. For generations, the Medicis were wealthy, and influential patrons of the Italian Renaissance. This villa was the home of Cardinal Fernando de' Medici. Trophies from other lands were often seized and brought to Rome by its military leaders. In 12 BC, a powerful tribune was unable to move an Egyptian pyramid, so he had a 100-foot high replica built on the border of the old city. The Basilica of St. John Lateran was the first cathedral built in Rome. It's the official papal throne and the residence of former popes before the building of St. Peter's. Palatine Hill is where Romulus allegedly began to build the city. Emperors Augustus, Tiberius, and Domitian had their palaces built on this, the most prominent of Rome's seven hills. Just below the Palatine lie the ruins of the city's first public arena. Before the Colosseum, this was the place where citizens witnessed everything from blood sports to comedic plays.
Baths of Caracalla was actually a community center that had two libraries, one with Latin scrolls, the other Greek. It could hold 1,600 bathers who had a variety of pools, saunas, and steam rooms to enjoy. Emperor Caracalla created this public spa where all Roman citizens were welcomed. Inside the Basilica de Santa Maria Maggiore are the remnants of the earliest Christian church in Rome. Today, this cathedral is the city's largest and most revered place to pray for the blessings of the Virgin Mary. The Feast of the Assumption is celebrated here by the Pope every August 15th. Many Romans complained about its outrageous presence and location. Victor Emmanuel Monument was built to commemorate Italy's unification in The Piazza of the People welcomes travelers entering the northern gate to the city through the Aurelian Wall. The obelisk of Ramses was first taken from Egypt and raised over the Circus Maximus before being moved here. 